What's going on everybody? This is your man Cat with Cat Fitness. Today we're giving you another health tip of the day. We're over here at the Trulies Herbs and More in Richmond, California. And uh, it's almost that season where people are starting to think, guess what? Cold, flu, sickness, you know what I'm saying? We're going to tell you something where you don't have to go get the cough syrup. You don't have to go get the, the Theraflu, the, uh, what is that, the NyQuil, all that kind of crazy stuff. You can do something very natural to boost your immune system. And uh, Brother Ed is going to tell us a little bit about it. Tell us, Brother Ed, what can we, can we use to boost our immune system? A simple berry. A berry? Yeah. What kind of berry is that? Elderberry. 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 I've never heard of elderberry. Tell us a little bit about it. Elderberry is super dark, super rich, kind of a tart berry, but um, immune system booster that um, directly affects cold and flu. Get that about it. If you got any problems right now, that's that's a, a instant relief. It takes, I'd say, within a day or two, you already start feeling relief from your symptoms and all that. This is a monster with the cold and flu. Um, for usage, make a tea out of it. Some people actually rehydrate them. These are dehydrated, but you can rehydrate them. Some people actually chew on them, throw them in something, but um, you can make a syrup. You can make your own cough syrup out of them. Instead of going to the store, spending $50, $60 on all these different medicines and this and that, and a little bit of this, a little bit of that, you can literally just throw these in a pot of hot boiling water, maybe add you a little bit of agave and some key lime just for a flavor, and literally just boil it down to a thickest kind of consistency and got a syrup a literally a powerhouse syrup without even going and spending and breaking your pockets now if i'm doing the tea or the syrup is there like a recommended amount should i drink like eight ounces it's of the tea it's a berry so i can it's, it's just how much you feel like you want to take i mean at least a cup or so you know a good amount in you but it's a berry so it's basically you making your own juice or tincture or something out of a fruit. And something that you said off camera that really stood out to me was that you can just add this to your daily nutrition plan. Oh, yeah. Right? You don't have to have, have, to. To have the cold or the flu no. to do it. No. It's you can like just... I said, the main thing, it's a berry. And being that it's a berry, you can just go in on it. But the good thing about it is that if you do have, you know, cold, flu, even allergies, this is something that you can just incorporate that will start keeping it under control. Okay, so now we know a little bit about the elderberry. Now, tell us, where do we get it? How do we find you guys? If you haven't heard already, naturally, McDonald Avenue in Richmond, 4113, 4113 McDonald Avenue. And if we want to find you guys on social media? Naturally Herbs on Instagram and Facebook. Guys, thank you for tuning in to another episode of uh, the Help Tip of the Day. If you're enjoying all the content, make sure you subscribe, like, and share. Make sure that you come check this place out because there's so many. We got the elderflower too, not just the berry. Come get it. Boom. Make sure you come through, even though um, they have so many different things from the sea moss, the burdock root, the elderberry, just all different things. You can see we haven't even touched on a quarter of the things that they have in here. Come down, get some information. Um, learn about how to really heal the body, y'all. We don't have to go to pharmaceuticals um, like we've been taught for so many generations that we have to go to pharmaceuticals, take all this medication and everything that, to heal the body. We can heal ourselves through just the simple foods that we're putting in and the herbs. So appreciate you guys for tuning in. You can follow me on my IG, Cat Fitness 3. If you want to check me out on Facebook, Cat Fitness. And please tune into the YouTube page. Comment, share, like if you're getting some valuable information from this channel. And we'll see you in the next video. Peace out.